hi my loves welcome back to the stars cartel channel if you don't know i am star i know y'all probably thinking star girl i thought your camera broke it did but then god reminded me that my phone at the whole reason i bought it is because it is a dslr camera thank you lord anywho let's <laughs> it is it is um a bit frustrating however because i i usually like to look at my phone for the message but it's okay i like pen and paper do exist okay so the message i heard is are you all right the scripture comes from mark 1 and 32 after sunset as evening drew on they brought him all who were ill and those possessed by demons before long, the whole town was gathered outside the door. Those whom he cured, who were variously afflicted, were many, and so were the demons he expelled. But he would not permit the demons to speak, because they knew him. Rising early the next morning, he went off to a lonely place in a desert. There he was absorbed in prayer. Simon and his companions managed to track him down. And when they found him, they told him, Everybody is looking for you. He said to them, let us move on to the neighboring villages so that I may proclaim the good news there also. That is what I have come to do. So he went into their synagogues, preaching the good news and expelling demons throughout the whole of Galilee. So here's the message. God said the show must go on. 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 Somebody didn't want to accept the good news of Christ. That's okay. Leave them there. If somebody, you know, I, I like, and I'm just thinking about, you know, the fact that I started talking about um, the fact that my camera was broken. And, you know, the message is, are you all right? And the scripture is where Jesus said, it's okay. We're moving on somewhere else anyway. This is a message for someone. There was someone that was not happy with you spreading the good news of Christ. They were not happy with you spreading the good news of Christ. They were not happy that you had the audacity to go around and tell people about the good news of Christ. But God says, that's okay. They are not the only people in this world that needs to hear the good news of Christ. There are other people that need to hear the good news. If they don't want to hear from you, that's their business. God said, there are more. There'll be more, there'll be more, there'll be more, there'll be more for you to save. There'll be more people for you to save. There'll be more people for you to help. There are more people that need to know about Christ. And like, you know, and that's really the message, y'all. Yeah, that's the message. Don't worry if someone is not acceptive to the fact that God called you, regardless if they don't like the way you dress, Regardless if they don't like the way you do your hair, regardless if they don't like the way you do your makeup, maybe they don't like the way you do your nails, maybe they don't like the way you speak, they don't like um your accent. You know, I know I have a country accent, I have a southern southern charm accent, okay, and then tag uh with a tad bit of hood with it, and it is what it is. I, that's okay, but God is saying that it is not your business to be concerned with that it is not you're not supposed to be worried about that don't worry about that there will be other people that need to hear the news of christ there'll be other people that need to hear about god there'll be other people that need to be saved that's the message y'all thank you guys for watching be sure to like share and subscribe